we all know how to create folders on the Mac. But did you know there is a bunch of different techniques you can use to do that? And do you also know how to make the folders automatically from the selection of files? Let me show you all the techniques right now. So let's create some folders. I believe you are already familiar with the right click. So perform the right click or control click to open the context menu anywhere on the desktop or inside Finder. It has to be on an empty space, don't select anything. And right on top, first on the list, is the new folder option. You can do it this way anywhere you want. Another option how to create a folder is to go to the menu bar, open the file menu and select new folder command. I guess nobody will be doing it this old fashioned way. But I am showing this actually because of this shortcut here. It's another and I think the fastest technique. It's very useful and I really recommend to learn this one. It's even faster than using the right click menu and I would prefer this option anytime. When you look at it closely it's easier than it seems. The shortcut for opening new finder window is command plus n. Then just add shift key to this combination and you are creating folders instantly. Another good thing is that when you create a folder the name is automatically selected. So you can immediately start typing your name of that folder. So it's really done in a second. Another way how you can create folders in Finder is to add an icon for that in the toolbar. So here in this Finder window right click the toolbar and select Customize Toolbar. Now drag this icon to the top and you can use it to create new folders in any Finder window. Unfortunately it will not work for the desktop unless you really switch here to desktop folder and click the icon. The folder will appear on the desktop, but I think the previous methods works better for this purpose. There is one more way how to create folder. Not many people know that you can create a folder from the selection of files. Let me show you. I will first find files I want to put in one folder and select them. Just by dragging the cursor over or I can hold down the command key and add more to the selection. Now use the right click again. And what you see here instead of a simple folder is a new folder with selection of free files. So I don't need to create a folder first and then put the files inside. I can save one step and do it all at once. I hope you have learned something new in this video. And if you did, you can leave a like below. This way you will let me know that you are enjoying these kind of videos and I can make a lot more. Anyway, thanks for watching and see you in the next video.